What is going on everybody? It's Medicosis Perfectionitis, where medicine makes perfect sense. Today, we will continue our microbiology and infectious diseases playlist. The famous group known as Bacillaceae, which are bacilli. They could be gram-positive, they could be gram-negative. Believe it or not, they could be bacilli or even cocci. Really? Yeah. Fortunately, the ones that are relevant to doctors are all gram positive, are all bacilli, and all of them make endospores. If you want to know what an endospore is, watch the previous video. And please watch these videos in order. As you know, bacteria by gram stain could be gram positive or gram negative. We're talking about gram positive rods today. As for the gram positive cocci, we have talked about all of these before. Today we are talking about gram positive rods that are spore forming. We will cover them in many videos and then later we'll talk about the non-spore forming gram positive rods. So let's focus on the gram positive rods that are spore forming. They are divided into aerobic and anaerobic, each of which is subdivided into motile and non-motile. Give me the motile aerobic, this is Bacillus turius. Non-motile aerobic, Bacillus anthracis. The anaerobic spore forming are the Clostridia. The motile ones are Clostridium tetani, Clostridium botulinum, Clostridium difficile. The non-motile is the Clostridium perfringens. Look at Bacillus turius, Bacillus anthracis, Clostridium tetani, Clostridium botulinum, Clostridium difficile, and Clostridium perfringens. Collectively, all of these doofuses are known as Bacillaceae, and all all of them make endospores. Let's review endospores quickly. For the more robust discussion, check the previous video. Endospores are only made by some gram-positive bacteria only under some circumstances when the environment is unfavorable. As for gram negatives, they never make spores. When the environment was favorable, the bacteria was dividing like crazy in the vegetative state, like a plant that grows and multiplies vegetation, vegetative. Not to be confused with your vegetative state when you are in the ICU. I will see you later. That's what ICU stands for. Anywho, when the conditions change from favorable to unfavorable, some gram-positive bacteria will make a spore. And now they are dormant, they are resting, they are not dividing. The endospore is dehydrated, multi-shelled, protective, and has calcium dipiclonic acid. Why does the bacteria do this? Because it's protective. It protects the bacteria from many unfavorable conditions. So, I am a gram-positive bacteria. I look at the environment. Favorable, I am in the vegetative state. Favorable, vegetative, which means I'm dividing, which means I'm germinating. But if the socioeconomic factors are unfavorable, I'll make a spore. I will not divide and I will not germinate. I will be dormant. So let's recap. We will talk about gram-positive bacilli that are spore-forming. Some of them are motile, such as Bacillus cereus, which causes watery diarrhea. Some are non-motile, such as Bacillus anthracis, which causes anthrax. By the way, anthrax is not the same as anthracosis. One has nothing to do with the other, except for the fact that both of them can affect your lungs, but that's a separate issue. So here is today's homework for you. Let me know in the comment section what's the difference between anthrax and anthracosis. If you like this video, please download my antibiotics course from my website medicosisperfectsnetis.com. It comes with 40 videos, questions and answers, cases and answers, my perfect snails ultimate notebook and a mind map to help you memorize all of these antibiotics. I also have a surgery high yields course and an emergency medicine high yields course. All of them are available at medicosisperfectsnailist.com. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe, hit the bell and click on the join button. You can support me here or here. Go to my website to download my courses. Be safe, stay happy, study hard. This is Medicosis Perfect Snailist, where medicine makes perfect sense.